Hello everyone, welcome back. This happens to be the first Filipino film that I watched and rather an impressive one I have to admit. Outside released on Netflix is not to be mistaken for a zombie flick. It is fundamentally a family drama. It is about a couple with two kids in a bad marriage who are fleeing from a zombie outbreak. Set in the backdrop of zombie outbreak, the film highlights the worsening troubles in already troubled times. If you expect a zombie horror with jump scare moments, then this is not for you. Francis is a middle-aged man with a troubled childhood who had been abused by his father during his childhood. He is fleeing the city with his wife and two boys from a zombie outbreak. They seek refuge in his father's house amongst sugarcane plantations away from the city, only to find his parents and servants dead due to the outbreak. He protects his family in this house from the zombie outbreak, or at least that's how it starts. But the darkness inside him starts growing in a cabin feverish manner and gradually he starts losing his mind which shows mild traces of Jack Nicholson's Jack Torrance in The Shining. What happened to Francis, what happened to his family is what the story is about. The film is held together by some spectacular performances by the lead characters. Sid Lucero, who plays Francis, stands out. He has a wide range of expressions and makes the viewers sympathize with him, pity him at times while getting us scared of him and making us hate him at other times. Cinematography is another hero in this film. Alternating between wide-angle shots and close-up shots, it brilliantly captures the isolation of the family while paying close attention to the emotions of the characters. The other major strength is the simplicity of the screenplay. The screenplay stays loyal to the plot, the place and the people and does not deviate in the pretense of intelligent filmmaking or mass pleasing. The biggest weakness of the film is the pace. Agreed it is a slow burner, but the screenplay could have been tighter just by avoiding lengthy silences that adds precious nothing to the progress. At many instances it feels like waiting forever to come to the point. While this film may not rub shoulders with the best of the international films, it is a film that deserves a chance. I can confidently say that there is no other zombie outbreak film that has taken this direction in storytelling. It is a breath of fresh air. Give it a chance and you may find yourself sharing my sentiments. Thanks for staying with me. I'll come back with my next review. Till then, bye-bye.